everybody, Tim here with today's episode of The Mandalorian, Season 2, Episode 7, Chapter 15, The Believer. I, I just got Daydream Believer stuck in my head, so ugh, that's going to be rough. Anyways, um, it was a good episode. It was a filler episode. So I've said this whole season, like, Episode 1 was great, Episode 2 was a filler, Episode 3 was great, Episode 4 was a filler. And then, so, 4... Five was great, and then six was great. I was like, oh my god, they broke it. They're they're doing just great now. Nope, here's the filler episode. We got one episode left. This is the penultimate episode. We got one episode left, and then you know that's going to have to be the good one. So they just kind of flip-flopped six and seven for the plots, and now we, we get our filler episode. Uh, Boba Fett's helmet looks fantastic. Like, it still has the little dink in the middle, but it's, I don't know, like, it, why did he, like, polish it up or whatever? So, it, that felt odd to me. The whole car chase. Um, so, Mayfield, who returns from a filler episode of season one, returns in this one. And the whole car chase was very Indiana Jones. I don't know why. I don't know if other people seem like it felt like Indiana Jones to you. Let me know. The facial scan, I squealed a little bit. So, I hated the moment when he pulls his helmet off in season one, I just felt like it was unnecessary. Like, even though it was Taco Atiti, but the IG, I think it was IG-88, I don't know, whatever. The robot was like, I am not a human, so no human has seen your face. And then he heals him. I don't know, it just felt too soon for me. Like, it felt too rushed, felt too soon, and I didn't like it. It kind of bothered me. This one felt better. I was really, really excited for it. And it just never ended. Like, it was so awkward and so antagonizing the entire time. And you could tell, like, it was Linus's blanket was ripped away. And, like, at first, when he first does it, like, he walks up to the computer and it, like, doesn't register. So he takes the helmet off. I'm just like, oh, my God. Like, I was like, oh, this is, this is the moment. Like, if they didn't do it in season one, but they had done it this one, it was the exact moment I needed. And then I'm like, okay, he's going to put his helmet on. They'll be done. And it'll be great. Nope, scene just kept going, and I was like, oh, and like, I I was with the, like, brown eyes and Mayfield and all that, I was like, this, this is how it felt, like, every time somebody said something, he's like, I was like, this is how awkward it is, it was great, Hess was fantastic, which I think it was kind of funny, because he was like the Night King from Game of Thrones, and the Mandalorian was the Viper from Game of Thrones, so we got like a little reunion there going on, even though those characters had no screen time whatsoever, not even the same seasons, but I was like, oh, that's kind of funny, that's kind of interesting, and I don't know, Mayfield literally almost left no impression on me in season one, but in this one, like, I was like, he was a, he was a good dude, he was, he was really, really nice, and like the whole thing about like, he's like, I still haven't seen your face. Let's just go. You did what you had to do. I did what I got to do. Let's just go. And it was great. I, the, I'll be honest with you, the entire time, I was like, Mayfield's going to die. Like, he's going to get shot and he's going to die. And then the Mandalorian will still be like, nobody alive has seen my face. But he didn't. Like, he, they actually let him go. And I was, I was amazed. I thought it was actually really, really well done. So I loved it. I still think it was a great episode. The worst episode of The Mandalorian is still better than a lot of other shows on TV right now. So. Still really, really liked it. I I am terrified for the next episode. This might be the first episode ever. Like, the child, Garogu, Baby Yoda, whatever, has never been in. I think this is the first episode. We've never, we didn't see him at all. So, that's kind of interesting. Loved it. Still think it was great, even if it was very fillerish. I don't know. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. And I will be very sad to see you guys next week for the season two finale.